Hey guys, what's going on? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay. Pause, pause. Okay. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we are back in the Pixelmon world where every like equals a random Pokeball and every subscriber equals a random Pokemon. So, yeah, last video got uh, two likes, but the short also got three. So we have five total likes. The way I'm going to do it is get one of these Pokeballs. These are exactly the order they were in in the creative inventory. And then this is for the random Pokemon, which I get two of. So I'm going to have a random number generator generate me five numbers from... 1 to 40, and that decides this. So, yeah, I'll be back once I get that up. And we're back with the number generator pulled up. And I'm going to click this five times and write down each of the numbers and get those Pokeballs. 17. 30. 29. 23, and last one, 3. Alright, now we grab all of those Pokeballs, we can close that. So, we have 17, so 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. A strange ball, a 30, so that's... 30, normal Pokeball, 29, a Beast Ball, 23, so 28, 27, 26, 25, 24, 23, a Heavy Ball, and 3, a Nest Ball. So those are the random balls that I got. Don't take that out of context. Don't clip that, please. <laughs> uh, Yeah. So now we go to the random Pokemon. I set up a command in here that uh, gives me a random Pokemon when I pull the lever. So, and I get two of those because we are at 56 subscribers now. And we started this series with uh, 54. So, yeah. Let's pull the lever. I got a Snorunt and a Thoro. I can ride him. Okay. So now we've got a couple of different Pokemon. And just to uh, make myself a little bit more, like, make this easy, I gave myself these three things in Anvil, because A, I can't craft it, so I'd have to find it. I don't know where to find it. But then also a healer and a PC. So then I can just have all the stuff near me whenever I need it. So yeah, let's, uh, can be used to catch Pokemon. Ultra Beast 1% chance. So this is like a Master Ball kind of, not quite, but it's like almost guaranteed catch. Um, low leveled Pokemon, increased catch rate, Premier Ball, okay, and a Heavy Ball on Heavy Pokemon. All right. And it is turning nighttime because I took too long to set this up. <laughs> All right, we're back in the morning. So I think today is a good day since we have a few Pokemon. Let's uh, let's finish out the team. Oh yeah, in, in between episodes I caught Magikarp with a Quick Ball. It wasn't anything special. And then also a Slowpoke, which was fairly easy as well. So, yeah. Let's see. Oh, I also have great balls. Alright, let's throw all these in here. Let's grab this one and this one just in case we'd find a low level that we want. But yeah, um, I think I'm gonna go grab myself a couple of these and we're gonna make myself an iron axe. It's 
so then I can start building a base and I'll cut back to when I have the materials so then I don't bore you with just collecting a bunch of random stuff. So yeah, I'll cut back to that. All right, we're back, and I just caught a Dreadnought and a Shelder. So, yeah, I used one of my new Pokeball. Well, two of them, I guess. I used a couple on, uh, not Shelder, the other one, uh, Dreadnought. But he's a big turtle, and I can ride him. Um. He doesn't swim, though. Ooh. Fossil. Wishy-washies. Okay, interesting. Alright. But, yeah, I also got a stack and a half, a little bit over a stack and a half of cherry logs. So, yeah. And then there's this also, uh, this purple logs that I wanted to come check out which are mahogany, and then there's the rainbow eucalyptus, I think is what these are, right? Yep. So, yeah, I'll, I'll work between stuff, but then I remembered about these pokey stops, so see if they've got anything. If I can spin them? I can't. Ooh, extra large XP candy. Star sweet, ultra balls. Man, lots of stuff. All right. I'm probably going to build my house around here just so I can get all these Pokestops every episode or so. Maybe more than once per episode. I don't know. Oh, there's a Chewittle. That's a Dreadnought's uh, smallest evolution. What, uh, the lowest evolution of it? Safari Ball. X Attack, Super Potion, and Go... Lower and cast. Is that a furfu? It's a high level furfu. Holy cow. Alright, and there's Snubble. Uh, three more right here. Throw those up there. And last one. Ooh, rare candy. Nice. A uh, deep sea scale, okay. Well, I'm gonna start my base this episode. Probably not finish it. Oh, it's far fetched. This is. He turns into sir fetched while well, this version does. Kinda like this version. <laughs> Just cause he like has like a celery stick sword and shield and stuff. It's kinda cool. That's a level 30 trainer. Uh, did heal all my Pokemon, so he probably could take him. Let's try it. Storm throw. Yep, there's one. Monkferno, another one. Oh, easy. Yeah, my th throw is pretty good. Not the best, but definitely going to help out the team a little bit. Did I get anything for defeating him? Um, just money, probably. I didn't pay attention. <laughs> but yeah, let's see, there's mushrooms over there too. There's a swamp over there. Let's build... Well, hello, Mr. Snubble. Let's build right over here. Oh, wrong button. Um, do I have any food on me? Ah, I put all my food away, of course. All right. Well, we'll go back for it later. Could build over on this hill right here. This wouldn't be too bad, like right around this area. So start clearing stuff out. And then I'll start building my home. All right, I will build it small for now. Two, three, four, five. 
All right, let's get just the outline of my house. Going and then we'll decide what we want to do with everything else. Then we'll have this one back area. Ah, why did it drop me when I was shifting? This one. Okay, one, two, three, four. Right here. Alright, and then we turn it into cherry planks. I like these planks. They're kind of cool. Fill that in later. But for now... Just gonna do this. And that'll be the doorway. Oh, wait, no, it won't. This will be the doorway. There we go. Oh, there's a cherry crafting table. Alright, back here we'll do that. Let's see. Hmm. We got some rainbow eucalyptus. Let's see what these doors would look like. Probably not great, but... Nah, maybe the mahogany because it'll be purple and red. We'll see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Might be too light of a purple though. Let's see. Oh, they're pinkish. All right, I can I can get down with that for now. Not that. Eh. 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 Okay. I'm terrible at this game. Holy cow. <laughs> I'm a little rusty. Oh, I have auto jump on. I'm going to take that off. All right. There we go. There we go. That looks good for now. We'll fill that in for now. Ah, that looks like a house. All right, sweet. Let's slowly walk back home. This. I don't have any food, so we're going to be waddling. What is this? I 
there's a hole in the ground. Can I throw something at it? That's something in the top right. I won't try. I don't know. Okay. Whatever. We'll walk slowly back home, I guess. Hmm. Ooh, Whalmer. That's a heavy Pokemon. Maybe. I'm gonna get up right next to him just in case. Bah! All right, let's try and catch him. Please, please catch. Did I get him? Aw, oh, broke free. Not nice. All right, whatever. I'm going to get home. Well, to my temporary home. Sleep, and I'll cut back to when I am chilling at my house. Yeah. Alright, we're back, and yeah, I just finished setting up, like, the basis of my base, so, uh, I did, yeah. I got the PC and the, uh, thing behind me, the healer, and the anvil put down behind me, so now I can do all the basic Pokemon, Pokemon thingies, like, switch out shelter for slow poke and such so yeah i'll see y'all in the next episode where hopefully we're gonna get a couple more random pokemon in and maybe we get something crazy hopefully we get a couple more pokeballs and can do some crazy things with that so yeah if you haven't already please like and subscribe it'll help out the channel and it'll help out this series so if you do like this series uh yeah consider Joining my crew, I guess. I don't know. Yeah. Bye.